Everyone, welcome to the Body Beat Down. What's going on, guys? How's everybody doing today? Doing well, thank you for asking. Body Beat Down here on this Sunday early afternoon. It's probably around 11 ish or so. I don't know. Somewhere in there. So we got a lot going on in the world right now. Ex-president, former president getting shot at. We got a handful of celebrities uh, that have died. And, uh, yeah, kind of a lot going on, I guess. Now, I know some people don't put much worth on celebrities, but I do. Especially the older ones from my generation and before. Because I find true talent and true worth and, and, uh, just certain qualities about these people that you don't really get today. So, yeah. A lot of people going. So anyhow, I was expecting on another subject. I ordered something last week. And uh, was expecting it by Friday or Saturday or somewhere in there. And uh, so I only got one piece of the puzzle, and uh, the other pieces of the puzzle did not arrive. So kind of threw a little kink in my plans of what I had to do things that I wanted to do you know it's always nice to get stuff like that on the weekends when I'm not working out that way I got time to you know do open boxes and fiddle with such things you know as needed and uh, so whatever uh, hopefully they'll be here by Monday we'll see so today I'll do this little video here I may do a, uh, a little round with my heavy bag and uh, upload a do a video of that. I wish more people would watch those. They're kind of fun. Something for you to watch while you're doing your own stuff. It's toasty out today. You know, I think back. I think a lot of times about stuff I used to do. And of course, I used to be in construction. I did that for about 12 years or so. And uh, anytime, you know, the heat pops up or, or it gets really cold out and all that, I'm just like, man, I'm so glad I don't do that no more. <laughs> That's so nice not to be out in that you know because sometimes you kind of miss those things oddly enough but then you remember how miserable it can be <laughs> 
So, uh, the same is true with cycling. I cycled for five and a half years, and I did it all year round. You know, not just spring, summer, and summer and fall, but, you know, I was out there pedaling on snow and ice like an idiot. Uh, you know, I've been out in, in the downpours and heat, humidity, like you wouldn't believe. Freezing temperatures, having sweat, snot, and everything else freezing on my face and you know it's uh it's just one of those things when I do something I do something I don't like to slack I don't like to miss which is kind of how you see me with my working out for the last three years and few months I don't like to miss if I'm gonna do something I like to do it so but, getting back to that, I, uh, I think about cycling sometimes and I'm like, you know, I miss it. But I don't know how I did it. <laughs> Out here in the heat and humidity. Because it's not pleasant. And my bike rides took anywhere from... You know, just a standard bike ride. It takes anywhere from about an hour to an hour and a half. And, uh, yeah, I, I don't really miss it. I do and I don't. <laughs> so, I still have my bike. And I do think about getting it out sometimes. But, man... Maybe this fall when it cools off, if it ever does cool off, maybe I'll go for a ride or two, who knows. Now as far as my daily walks go, well, those of you that follow my channel know I used to do them just like cycling or anything else, every day. Rain, shine, dead of summer, dead of winter. Two o'clock in the morning, or two o'clock in the afternoon, seven o'clock at night, whenever. Did them all the time. And sometimes I miss doing those on a regular. But, again, it's one of those things. You know, I'm trying to get out here and do it at least once a week. So, today, like I stated, I'll, I'll have this video for you. I may get on the heavy bag, do a video there, and uh, I got a few songs that I'm, I guess I'll drum to, make some noise to. wish I could find a cheap easy solution to my audio problems when I'm doing my drums without spending so much money and there's a lot of options it's just what route do you want to go personally I'd be happy with just one good microphone and that microphone and the editing software working correctly together and not distorting my sounds because everything that I have distorts my sound and the main camera that I have to use is my digital SLR that's oh, 14 15 years old 
because it's the only one that doesn't totally distort the sound uh, like some of my newer devices such as my action camera such as my phone such as my web camera they distort everything to the point to where you can't really use it so and it's mostly with my hi-hats hi-hats are your two little symbols take uh, normally to your right or to your left that you open and close with the pedal you know and you hit and whatever anyway normally those are the ones that sound distorted almost like the audio can't handle that much or that kind of frequency or something I don't know it's weird so that's why I use my old digital SLR because that's probably before they started screwing with the audio engineering the audio things of such and devices now they got all kind of things that they try to put in there and to try to make the audio better but it usually uh, it don't always work trees sure would be nice if uh, we could get people to stop cutting all the trees down Whew. so if you follow my channel let me pop the screen so I can see so if you pay attention to my channel you know that uh, I've reached every goal that I've went for on all my lifts and all I'm lacking is my 405 pound one rep max goal 405 pounds so we're still on track for that in 2024 I'll get it I've gotten every goal that I've went for and uh, I, I see no reason why I can't just get this one and get it over and done which leads me to you know after you reach your goals and that's all you really care to reach you don't want to go any higher once you reach your goals well then you're kind of just working out at that point and I know it's hard to keep viewers interested even when you're going for heavy you know weights and or a lot of reps and all this kind of stuff it's hard enough to keep people interested with that so I know a lot of you are probably tuning out because you know my videos have are not me really of pushing things super hard anymore but we don't always have to push things in the gym hard it's okay to work out and not kill yourself and that's just kind of where I'm at that don't mean I don't have workout sessions where I don't go heavy and try you know a little harder it just means for the most part you know we're just working out so I'm trying to save all my energy all my mental energy my mental status everything I'm trying to save that from my bench press you know and then once I get that then we'll go from there and uh, you know I'll, I'll determine if I just want to kind of stay you know light medium kind of weights or if I want to stay heavier or go heavier it just kind of depends because it's been a little over three years now of go 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 and there's not a lot of people out there that are sticking with it like I've stuck with it these three years and however many months 
Because uh, it's not easy. on the last couple of weeks or so of summer break we start back to school I believe August 1st 2nd somewhere in there third first second third I don't know somewhere in there <sighs> I can't say I'm looking forward to it it seems like it gets more stressful every year I think a lot of that is number one they don't reprimand the kids when they act up on the bus they just kind of shake their fingers at them and give them a dirty look and try to scare them. That don't, that don't work. Number two, uh, our pay. Our pay sucks. We should be making twice what we make easily. Uh, if I told people what I made, you would laugh and ridicule me and talk down to me and all that good stuff so we'll keep that kind of under wraps as you know everyone's everyone has the right to do what they do but we also have the right to complain a little bit by being underpaid for what all we have to do not just the training you have to do to get your your CDL, your Class B endorsement to drive a bus, but everything you have to do every year to keep it. We have a couple of classes that we have to attend, which is on the 24th and 26th of this month. Plus we have an online course class training that we have to do every year. Plus, every three years or so, three, four, whatever years, I don't know, we have to go get recertified for CPR training, and I got to do that this year. That's one of my classes. I'm not going to CPR none of them kids. Anyway. We're grossly underpaid and underappreciated and and uh, honestly so are teachers. Even the bad teachers deserve <laughs> a raise. Imagine babysitting kids these days for seven, eight hours. Whew. I only have them for an hour in the morning and an hour in the evening. I couldn't imagine seven hours a day. Well, anyway, guys, I think I've talked about enough things. So, I hope everybody has a good day. Try and do something healthy for yourself inside and out. Because it not only helps, you know, your, your body physically, it helps you mentally. And we all could use a little mental help. Believe me. So... Hope you enjoy the channel. Uh, make sure you like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the body beat down. Let's get me to a thousand subscribers and let's try to make them more active. Let's try to get people active in here. That's what we need, more activity. All right, get up, get out, get red, do it to it. We'll see you next time. On the body beat down. That car right there is 
extremely random. It's a lady that bought something from me off Marketplace, and she's coming to pick it up, and uh, I didn't even know she was coming over. So, that worked out pretty well. Okay, cool. Get up, get out, get around, and do it, do it!